I'm Things getting to you. The eye today. Yes, you and me both. I have to say, you can tell from beginning of the week, middle of the week, they start to get a bit, woo, you know, not quite. Not okay, okay. just as well. That's why. Ladies and gentlemen, Gemma Woodman! Yeah! Hello to uh, David, bloke I met in the West End yesterday driving a van. He stopped me. He says he knows me off the telly. He says, You're all right, you. He says, When you were on Blue Peter. Mm. Oh, <laughs> what a nice man. Now, oh. Over the past few weeks, we've all been enjoying the phenomenal success of Big Brother, haven't we? We've all yeah, been enjoying yeah, yeah. it. What's that story, by the way? They, they, they pretended they're under the bed sheets and they took clothes in with them and they threw clothes out so it looked like they'd been getting jiggy, but they hadn't really. Craig and the new, new lady. Girl. New girl Claire. Claire. Yeah. So it never happened. It was yeah. a fix. Oh, that's pointless and oh. pathetic. Sorry, so carry on. <laughs> oh, well, uh, even our own ratings here on The Big Breakfast tended to nudge up a few places when we featured the rejected housemates. Amazing. Yeah. So, uh, uh, in a desperate bid for more viewers, we thought we'd carry on with that. Oh, yeah, and yeah. uh, why not? So, let's jump on the bandwagon. We've done just that, uh, except that uh, we've condensed <laughs> the whole programme. Ladies and gentlemen, we bring you six contestants, two hours, one winner... <gasps> It's Baby Brother. Yeah. Missing the outside broadcast, because I do like yeah, it out there. Missing you. <laughs> it, oh, oh, it's all gone wrong. Oh, gone wrong. So I've just knocked over a display in the house. Um, <laughs> but I do miss it out there in what is essentially the real world. Oh, it's got myself down on there. Oh. oh. It's nice to be liked, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> Congratulations on being the first one yes. to be evicted. Are you, oh. are you very disappointed? I won't, well, you probably still get the front cover, I don't know, smash hits or oh, TV quick yeah. or something <laughs> like that. Are you still going to be able to like, release a single? That you're 40. Um, so, uh, 40. So, um, now, we, we all did the, uh, the pictures of each other and now. I think why, actually... why do you think everybody hated you so much? I said about you. She said the same. No, she <laughs> said you had too much makeup on. Oh! oh. 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 There. Welcome back to the Big Breakfast. Uh, I'm Richard Bacon, I believe. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah and I'm Lisa Rogers. Hey. Hey. It's a cracking show today. A little experiments going full seam ahead. Baby brother, big brother in two hours, but still with manipulation. Like More of that to come. That's not all, though, isn't it? I'm just poking <laughs> you. Did it hurt? Uh, no, do it again. A bit more gently. There's still. More to come, though, isn't well, there? Well, that was quite nice. <laughs> okay. Yes, uh, we're going to give you the chance to your favourite big breakfast interviews oh, of the year in Big uh, Breakfast yes. Gold. That's and come... you get two surprise one today because we're going to play your two most favourite that you vote for today. That's incredible. Oh, are we, are we, we short like of guests, by chance? No, uh, surely not. And our new recruit, uh, Mike McLean, uh, is uh, he's out. Before that, we're a bit over, so let's go straight to uh, Gemma Woodman, who's got the news. Yes! Take the tea from you, Sarah Kaywood, pour it in the urn and see how many you've got on our fantastic markers here. Richard Blackwood with 12. Yeah. So that's wow. what to be. You're oh, well, there. Yeah, you see, I'm only five foot and three quarters. Oh, I'm next shorter. To back to back. Yeah, I've got big heels on. I've got big heels on. Big yeah. heels. Yeah. Lisa, you've got to take your heels off. Otherwise, oh, it doesn't work. I, it'll take oh, five <laughs> hours for me to take my heels. Look at them. Look, there's, oh, a whole, there's a whole artist's work. Right, forget it. Work oh, thing would be fun. Clearly not. <laughs> right. Okay, talk to your callers. Come on. Moving on to Julie. Hello, Julie. Going to Tiffany from Devon. Hi, Tiffany. Hi. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Lovely name. Do people used to call you Tiffany from EastEnders and get teased about your name and yeah. stuff? Yeah. Yeah, Tiff. All right, Tiff. Yeah, you, your other half's not called Grant, is he? No. Never heard that before, have you? Sorry. Good. Uh, how many cups of tea do you reckon you're going to get in the urn? Uh, five. Five. <laughs> oh. There's been oh. an incident, viewers. <laughs> <laughs> There's been um. an incident involving <laughs> oh, Jeremy's pants. Oh. Oh. And we've got the grand total of one oh. cap oh. of tea. Oh. Yeah. I believe you're the winner. Yeah, oh, thank you. That's thank you. That's delighted. Delighted. Got anything to say to Sarah? A PC is me wing it way to your house. Thanks, Adrian. Thank you. Bye -bye. Cheers, son. Bye. Right now it's Channel 4. You're watching the Big Breakfast, and we're done to a turn every morning. Oh! Sarah!
Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. Come on, come and sit down. Take a seat on the bed there. What went wrong there? Only the second person to be evicted. It didn't last too People didn't like you very much. I don't know. No, did did some mud, mud painting? Yeah. Who would I give it to? Uh, who do you would you like to give it mm -hmm. to? Look at something. What, what's, what's the cutaway on this? Hmm? I didn't actually couldn't. You <laughs> just didn't like him, just did you? Didn't. Better. Yeah. Fantastic. Right, well, sorry about that. <laughs> now it's back to Richard for the next challenge. <laughs> You're not singing still not good enough. Mike, that was an immense mullet. <laughs> okay, perhaps later we're going to have a mullet tree. The now. Later, we use him. We use Johnny from our feature over here. That's tremendous. Mike, speak to you later. Yeah. 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 See you later. Yeah. Um, now, your votes have been coming in all morning in their trillions and squillions to vote for the Big Breakfast Gold interview that you most wanted to see. Is the first of our two. It is um, Kevin Spacey speaking to Johnny. That happened in January. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. Where have you been? More, fo earlier. more fool you. Yeah, welcome back. It's the 23rd of August. I'm Richard Bacon. Hey. Hey. Oh. I'm wearing a beautiful custard yellow shirt. And I'm Lisa Rogers. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Well, you know I've been a bit conscious about this shirt. No need to have little digs at it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's my oh, chest. I see. All right, I'll shuffle over here. <laughs> now, all morning, we've been conducting something of a scientific experiment. Well, we think it is. Uh, it's a feature. Basically, it's Big Brother in two hours. Hence why we've called it Baby Brother. Yeah. Gun to blossom, so oh, it's really yeah. working. Bullet. And we're not simply jumping on a bandwagon, folks, either. Oh, not in any way, shape or form. More of that to come. And Marilyn's nothing at all like the real Mel. And here's a few more of the exciting things to come on today's Big Breakfast. Yeah. Are you, are, oh, come over here, sit down. Are you gutted? Yes. Are you? Did you think you were fun. doing quite well? Yes. Why, why do you think they voted you out? Falling, falling at the, at the third fence. Right, back to Rich for the next challenge. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what went wrong? I mean, were you tempted to take in a mobile phone, secreted on your person, to try and <laughs> knowing you didn't cheat? No, no, no mobile phones in your person. <laughs> well, commiserations. Back to Rich for the next challenge. Really hate. Was there anybody in that house you really couldn't stand? Right. Your time, Marilyn. Give me your. Oh, welcome back to Big Breakfast. It's not now time to display our undoubted. Passion for fashion. It's the king of the fashion world. It is Wayne Hemingway. Yeah. Morning, Wayne. Now, what's, uh, what's going on in the world of fashion at the moment? Well, for some... You're drawing your pension. It's, no, it's true. This is a really cool thing to do. Panic is spreading through the handicraft world. Oh. Fitwear has been in the news massively the last few weeks. Chief... In... No, no! no. How has he never yeah. heard of Julian MacDonald? Yeah, and how can it, how can it be... <laughs> When, it, when, no, knit, when a knitwear degree leads to cat in a rough by tapestry design. Oh, let me see that. No. That is fantastic. Yeah. I mean, that is that what a knitwear degree is all about, isn't that it? That looks like my cat Jones, yeah. except he hasn't got a rough thing. So and he's I, got a body as well. And do you know that the chief inspector of schools could not make one of those? He couldn't. I, get him on here. If he can make a cat in a rough, then he's got then he's got grounds to say things like he's been I saying. I bet he can't. I, I bet, bet he can't. can't. I bet he couldn't make a cook breakfast. Breakfast, Chris Woodhead. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Don't right. can stay there with me. Right. Things, things to talk about. What this else week. have we got? Patrick Cox convertible shoes. <gasps> oh, lovely. And looks looks like this strap on and changed the way that. Oh, clever, isn't it? It's like things to make and do <laughs> with your shoe. And then we've got this picture on here. Look at bring bring the first picture up of solar screen. No, oh, kind of normal looking. Yeah, you. Which, you lie on there on a sunbed or in the sun and it gives... It's like no. a sh it shadows the bits... A transformation. 19 quid from Solar, solar no, Street. No, our Pammy right. Anderson look like doesn't need one of those. Now, this week, I've had a fantastic time going around second-hand stores. And I, re there's some really exciting things. First of all, I found this in Oxfam. All the 80s things back, I was it? there slavering. I've got to try it on. Oh, this is fantastic. It's fantastic. <laughs> and, and, you know, when you see things like that from shops like Relic, and let's look at that. Yeah. Oh, that's super...
Okay, Carol what have the models got on mine? First of all, we've got Louise. Now, she's got the real Dynasty 80s look. Look at that. This, this is exciting. I've been here four years. Shoes from Relic. Oh, oh she's gone. She's it's gone. gone. She's gone. Come, and show, come back and show us your shoes. Yeah. It's the first those, time. I'm just a bit nervous. Your hair looks lovely. Look at those Second-hand shoe. It is wear it now. Yeah, I, I wanted to nickel my mum's clothes in the 80s and wear them. And did. And I will be and doing I it. I didn't. <laughs> you didn't. Perhaps you should have. But I knew a man that did. <laughs> Brilliant, Wayne. Thank you very much indeed. We'll hear more from you Cheers. next week, hope. Now we know what to wear for a great night out. Um, you can go and try it on. Here's the break. Yeah! Oh, welcome back. It's going to be breakfast. All right, all right. Me old cock sparrows. Lord, love a I can't talk now. I've got Payne McGillivar. Yeah, we're all that in it then. It was amazing. Not very good. Yes, it's They're all terribly simple. Mr. Richard Bacon will show Marilyn, our baby brother winner, a series of pictures which sum up Cockney rhyming slang, and she has to guess what they mean, like apples and pears, picture apples and pears, the answer is, of course, stairs. And however many she gets right in 45 seconds, that's what the winner's got to guess. OK, we're going to go to Michaela. Hello? Oh, no, we're not going to go to Richard. Sorry, Richard. Are you there, me old oh, china place? Uh, <laughs> nothing wrong with looking daft, Richard. I do it. Well, all the time, really. Now we go to Michaela. Hello. Hi. <laughs> now you can see that Marilyn. Well, good luck to all three of you. Richie, let's play Cockney or to see. Yay! God, I'm really shocked. I thought things weren't going so well for me this morning, but uh, I feel so much better now. The winner is Jason. You actually, you actually scored. You said two more than Marilyn actually got. She got zero. D yeah. Did you get any of those, Jace? For the big breakfast news and weather. Yeah. Oh, we look forward to that. Uh, before I do some happy goodbye. It's an apology, uh, and it's an important one. Uh, now, on Wayne's item earlier, we on the big on the net. That was talked about in that item. That is something that we are simply not willing to endorse. And I'm not being flippant or ironic or sarcastic. It's meant. So yeah, let's lift the spirits. Grandma but, criminals are not good. Uh, now, listen. Here's uh, Marilyn. Uh, you didn't binge, and you can win another holiday in Ibiza or a PC. So it's well worth joining us. Oh, and we've got more big breakfast gold. The best interviews that we've ever had. Fat, did you say fat babies? Yeah, fat babies. Well, well, that's we also a quick thank you to Sarah Jane, <laughs> Pamela Anderson. Look at that. Thank you, Sarah.